Starting in September, we will go back to the waterfall schedule. Students take seven classes and attend six on each day. The only change will be moving to three lunches, and the extra 25 minutes will be moved between third and fourth periods to create community block. Students will go to their community block room every day and do one of four things depending on their grade. Community meeting, the name for the new advisory, focus block, a time for students to catch up on homework and other tasks, and assembly, either in person in the auditorium or via Zoom, and some students, the Passion Projects Pilot Program. Here is a graphic of the new schedule. As you can see, you will go to your community block room every day. Each grade level is assigned to one of the four elements of community block. For example, on days when we start with A block, during community block, grade 9 has community meeting. Grades 10 and 11 have focus block, and grade 12 has an assembly. On G day, everyone has focus block, and on other days it changes. The community block schedule will be posted in every classroom. Now we'll have some more students and teachers explain each element of community block. Community meeting is the new advisory. The study group that helped to redesign the program this past year worked on improving it in five main areas. A program rebrand, hence the new name, community meeting, new big picture goals, increased frequency, intentional configuration of students and staff, and enhanced content. One change we're excited about is that each community meeting classroom will have co-advisors, so you'll get to know more than one adult in the building during your community block each day. The study group of students, teachers, and administrators work deliberately to create goals for community meeting that would be relevant and worthwhile to students. The program's new goals are building meaningful relationships, student leadership, inclusion, acceptance, and understanding, and citizenship. We hope the goals of the new program will support student development in many areas and help to create a positive school culture. In addition to the co-advisors for the community block rooms, the community meeting sessions will have student community leaders. These students have applied to and been recommended by teachers for a course called Leadership and Community that will help them plan and prepare for facilitating the community meeting activities each cycle. Community leaders will have voice and choice in the development of community meeting, which will help meet the earlier stated program goal of student leadership. The rest of the school communi community can help meet the student leadership goal by respecting and supporting the community leaders who facilitate their community meetings each cycle and also aspire to be leaders in their own way. In addition to having community meeting once a cycle during our new community block, each grade level will also have an assembly once every seven days. Assemblies will cover a wide range of topics over the course of the school year, including, but not limited to, school and class updates, club presentations, art performances, and possibly guest speakers. Bringing the entire class together each week will be a nice way to keep everyone engaged and connected with the happenings at DHS. Focus is a time for students to catch up on tasks for school, work on executive functioning skills, and spend time reflecting on whatever they need to do in order to make their day productive and enjoyable. FOCUS is actually an acronym. The F stands for finish work, the O stands for organize, the C for communicate, the U for utilize the time, and the S for self-care. During this time, it will be important for students to stay focused and engaged on one of the elements in the acronym so that the block is helpful for them to further their academic, and social-emotional development within the hours of the school day. The Passion Projects Pilot Program will run every E-Day. On E-Day, each grade level has a focus block. However, students are able to opt in to taking a Passion Project on E-Day instead of going to their regular community block room for focus. A small group of teachers will be running individual sessions for specialized interests. For example, passion projects might include crafts, recipe swap, book club, trivia, and much more. If you are interested in being a part of the Passion Project Pilot Program, more information and descriptions of options will be provided during Community Block in September and Passion Projects will start running in October. <laughs> I thought you just put me on the spot. One word. 
Um, hopeful. Energized. Eager. Proud. Excited. Empowered. Psyched. Ready. Hopeful. All right, do it again. One word. Do you want a different word? No, hopeful. Hopeful's fine? Yes. Hopeful. 